So the volcano strike happened here one day ago. Let's see what happens today. Anything changes. Maybe I will put it here. Yeah, I'll do that. See, the volcano helped me. I can rebuild now. The base will look better now. Oh, maybe that's too close. If I put walls here, assuming they even patch them, maybe it's too close. Oh, well. They will make everything right in the end? Yeah, I hope so. I have my doubts about some things, but I think they'll do okay in the end. The other good thing is all the rot is gone. I don't know if that's a good thing, entirely. It's okay, I guess. I have room now. There's a lot of room here now, so this is... This is like a real dock now. All the open space. You can see the water, it's so beautiful. Some volcanic ash, but it's okay. So it's been about a day and a little bit since the first volcanic strike ended. I don't even know how long it takes for Blubber to rot. It just kind of became rot because I wasn't ready for it. Uh, I didn't check the, the chest over here until it was too late. All I saw was rot. How good the chilled amulet is now. Let's see, is there anything I have to do before I leave? Still no warnings yet, so they're not as frequent yet. Uh, they, they still seem to be the same, I guess? came after three warnings though, I'm pretty sure before it was four warnings. Okay, that's warning number one. Uh, about... What is it? One... A day and a half after the first volcanic strike began. I'm gonna leave now, I guess. Just in case. Turn this into jerky. The jerky will be helpful.
Is there a glomer equivalent? No, there isn't. Grab the fire or the uh, ice stuff just in case. Got two of them, I guess. Might as well use them up. So the next warning should be about nighttime. Rip jellyfish. Volcano attack actually killed the jellyfish. It's kind of cool. Nighttime volcanic strikes might be very scary now. I think most of the, uh, the times that I actually got hit were during nighttime. So, uh, the frequency is seems to be static. Does killing Chester give naughtiness? I don't even know. So I want to keep my HP as high as possible now. Above 300 if I can. Usually I do it anyway. Well, usually I keep it around 300, then I double heal. But now I have to keep it above 300 and just heal when I can. So if the frequency doesn't change, the first volcanic strike will be around here. Uh, the next warning will be about here, and the next strike will be here. If the frequency does increase, that means that uh, it might come here. This will be the next volcanic strike if it increases. But I assume not. Because I'm still only like seven days into the season. Probably gonna keep my health at near 500 always now. Though getting hit twice in a row does kill you still. So maybe it doesn't matter that much. Maybe it's more about. Uh, just in case I get hounds, or just in case I take damage from the waves or something. Keeping it as high as possible is good. So three warnings. The second volcanic strike has three warnings. And it should be about here. This is what I mean by keeping timers. I know that basically everyone doesn't do this. And that's why they die. Or they complain about stupid things. Oh, there was no counter to it. No. I don't think so. The Hound Wave should be arriving soon as well, so if the Hound Wave coincides with Volcanic Strike, I need to get to an island. Uh, the frequency of the Volcanic Strikes could be very dangerous. If I take 300 damage, I die, which means that I should be carrying armor with me, actually, uh, all the time now, instead of no armor all the time. Okay, that's one thing I didn't consider. I guess I have to bring armor with me. With the Football Helmet, I should be able to survive. Two strikes? 800 HP per helmet? What else is there? Is it 80% damage reduction, 800 HP? I can't remember the stats exactly. Uh, but it should be fine. So 
Volcanic Strike should begin soon, like really soon. Basically now soon. So it's two seconds to two point five seconds for delay. One strike every three seconds. So it's the same as the first time. Three warnings, uh, 1.5 days in between, three seconds between each strike, two seconds before landing. Are you serious? That's it? What a joke. That lasted like one notch. Hope I get hit so we can see how it handles with the patch. What do you mean by that? The second part. Do you want me to get hit? I can try it out. For the sake of science. You said it's 300 damage, right? If I do get hit, it has to be like within the next next patch. You can tank a couple of meteors in the me in the armored boat. I was told it was 300 damage, so you can only take one hit if it's 300. Okay, I'm gonna test it next time then. This is worth testing. Oh my god, the blubber rots now. I mean, we're playing early access to test, right? It's not really for anything else. I just wish that Clay would listen to feedback from people who actually knew what they were doing. But it is important to also listen to people that don't know what they're doing. So the entry level of the game uh, is something they can understand and assess. The problem doesn't... Oh, whoops, wait. Did I feed the octopus? I can't remember now. Oh, I did. I think I did. The day is so short now. I'm, I'm kind of confused. But the problem is not with like people playing the game. It's more like the problem with the patches. I would say it's better to make a big patch with like everything resolved, rather than slow patches that also break things. If you're gonna do slow patches or small patches, I should say, uh, just do very very minor patch changes. Very very minor. Wait, you actually got hit twice? Is it that bad? That's kind of interesting. Alright, so if the next wave comes at the same time, the first warning will be uh, a day and a half from the beginning of the volcano strike, which was here. So it'll be here. This will be the next warning. And then... Two, three, four. Is that it? Did I calculate that right, or is it wrong? I feel like that's kind of wrong. The first warning was here. Warning, 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 strike. And then the second one was... Warning, 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 strike? Or was it always the same? Oh, jeez, I forgot now. Okay, well the volcano started here. So if it was one and a half days, it should be around here, actually. Oh, right, 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 it's here. One and a half days is here. And then warning, 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 strike. So the next strike should be here on day uh, 72. 
assuming the frequency doesn't go up. We're about eight days into the season right now. So the frequency could could actually increase here. We'll find out. We'll test it for science. The hound wave should be coming within the next two days, I think. Very soon. So hopefully the hound wave doesn't coincide with the volcanic strike. 